Good morning, you guys. Um, I got a package from Amazon. Start off the day with a little haul. I am obsessed with seaweed. I'm addicted to seaweed, and this is a new flavor from this brand that's not sponsored, my favorite, um, but Chili Lime. So excited. I got these little seaweed rolls. These ones are all vegan. Sometimes they have fish in them, so you have to check. And then this is my number one all-time favorite, teriyaki seaweed. Like... Do I have a problem? Maybe, but is it a good problem to have? Absolutely, yes. I am gonna go for a little walk outside, I think, because we love that for us. I literally look crazy. I can't even shave my face because I look crazy, but that's okay. Um, yay. This is so much seaweed. <laughs> this is so much seaweed, but I love it. Vlog, I'm getting work done on my computer and I just pulled up Spotify to play some music and what the heck, this doesn't feel real at this point. No pun intended. No pun intended. Also, I love this layout. Isn't this crazy? Like, this happened to be... This is, like, where the Hollywood sign is, but it just happened to be the perfect photo getting the whole Hollywood sign in there. Um, but, you guys, this number... This means more, I think, than you will ever know. And I will keep this video forever and look back at this because this means so much. Like, literally, look. Um, 673,000 of you guys listening to little songs I wrote in my bedroom. Like, I... Ah, uh, like I don't, uh, I don't even know what to say. I'm like tearing up. My allergies are so bad, I'm losing my voice. Oh my God, everyone's going through it. So I'm like trying to rest and drink lots of water. I took Mucinex because my I have like really bad sinus is with allergies and like migraines, which sucks. But this is insane. Like I'm gonna like start crying because what the heck? Three million, three million of songs that I wrote in my bedroom because I was sad and I didn't feel good and that just means so much to me. And I love you guys. I'm actually crying right now. Oh my God, no. Oh my God, no, you can see me kind of. I'm crying, I'm crying. Hello, my little besties. Coming to you from my bedroom floor. I took a shower, but I didn't wash my hair. So my hair was like kind of wet, but not really wet. You know what I mean? Um, I put on a cozy little lavender. It's giving lavender haze, lavender haze sweater vibes. It looks really good with the red nails, but I thought we could do a little old school I don't know what this is. Everyone's like sick right now. Like my allergies are so bad right now. But you know what? We're drinking water. You're gonna drink water right now too. Cheers, let's go. You guys be proud of me. My room is pretty much almost clean. I've almost put away everything. So yay, yay on that. Um, I've been reading some books. I've been journaling a lot. Like here's my journal, you guys. It is getting so full, but I love it. Um, and I got this new book that I've been I follow this girl on Instagram. She's one of my favorite authors and like creators, I guess. And this is her book. It's Bianca Sparacino. I think that's, I don't know if I pronounced that right, but um, a gentle reminder. I carry this in my bag because I love it so much, but there's one I want to read. I was going to make a TikTok and read it. I'll do that too. But um, okay, I'm going to read a little excerpt from this because this is what I needed to hear. And I feel like there's somebody else out there who needs to hear this as well. This is from page 100 and 101 of A Gentle Reminder. I also love the color of this. It's giving Evermore. It's giving fall. It's giving my color. Okay. It is it is okay to want love. At the end of the day, human beings need connection. We need one another. You can be the most foundationally sound person. You can be your own home. You can be so deeply content within your solitude. But that doesn't take away from the fact that love is a beautiful experience. That love is something worth searching for. Love is something every single human being desires, and there are so many versions of love that you can find in this world. Love is seeing a smile crack across the face of your best friend. Love is hearing your mother's voice. Love is pine and blooming all around you, in the places that take your breath away, in the trips that change you, in the risks that you take that force you to open up to the world and pour your curiosity, curiosity into it. I'm already like tearing up. But love is also seeing something astonishing and wanting to squeeze the hand of some someone beside you. Someone you've given your heart to. Love is hearing them singing in the shower and laughing at all of their horrible jokes. It's smiling to yourself and connecting with the fact that you found someone like you in a world of billions. Love is the hope you feel in your chest when you meet someone you just know in a bizarre, all-consuming way that they're going to mean a lot to you. That you are going to clear a little corner of your soul out for them. Love is 2 a.m. grocery store runs for chocolate and stolen moments on city streets and curling into the whole of them on your way home after a long night. Love is the quietest kind of beauty. These moments seem small, but they aren't. They're so unbelievably full and you can be whole on your own and still crave them. You can be whole on your own and still want to care deeply for another human being. Embrace wanting to risk it all. It is one of the greatest things you'll ever do. I'm like getting sad reading that. But it's so true. It's like you can be whole.
and it's not a bad thing to want love. It's not a bad thing to want that. I don't know. Anyways, I <laughs> I need a bigger bag because I feel like I'm always, especially in LA, because everything's so far away that if I go somewhere for a day, like I don't have time to come home. And I am somebody who needs to carry all of my books, all of my journals with me at the same time. And I was just going through like my old bags. Like this is just an old random black purse. I need to clean it off, it's dirty. I've had this literally for probably eight years. I was letting my mom use it, but she hasn't used it in a while. But um, I need a bigger bag because this one is like big, but it's not big enough to fit all my journals and my Polaroid camera and all my like, you know, little sentimental things and my headphones. But yeah, I'm gonna like switch it. And then should I do like a what's in my bag in the car? I carry some fun things in my purse. And there's a, th there's a new addition to my purse. I'll show it later, whether it's in today's vlog or tomorrow, but there's a new addition to my purse that I'm gonna carry in so that I always have it when this moment happens. I'm being prepared for this moment that's gonna happen. Anyways, yes. Hi, you guys. I've just been running some errands. I'm currently eating chocolate in my car. Honestly, living the life. Living the life right now, living the life. I've been listening to Born to Die because I feel so alone on a Friday night. Can you make me feel like home if I tell you your mind? It's like I told you, honey, don't make me sad. Don't make me cry. The road is long, we carry on. Try to have fun, why is this car staring at me? Try to have fun in the meantime. Come take a walk on the wild side. Let me kiss you hard on the partner. You like your girls insane. Choose your last words. This is the last time, because baby, you and I were born to die. Hm. This is what it feels like to be in your 20s right now. Like, what's happening? I don't know you guys. I don't know much. But I do know that vegan chocolate is so good. And I'm the next international superstar. That's the one thing. I'm like, I have confidence in my work and in myself and in my abilities, which is like step one. Like once you know yourself, that's amazing. But then step two is like finding those other people to live life with. Cause you know what? If you could do it all by yourself, that's boring and that's lonely and that's sad. Trust me, you want other people to do things with. You want other people to experience life with. And I love that. Um, I was talking about this in yesterday's vlog. I love like, I love relationships. I love getting to know people. I love being able to love people. I love loving people. Um, and it's a challenge, but it's a fun challenge. So yeah, you guys, I don't know. I don't know, but definitely don't go through his following. This is, this is going off on a tangent. Do not go through somebody's following. Don't go through it. Even if it's somebody you're like, I'm over him. Just don't do it, girl. Just don't do it. You're going to do it. But just don't. Don't do it. Um, I've done it multiple times. I'm good at things. That's the thing. I'm like, I'm in, I'm like a little FBI agent. For real. Like, I can find anybody in a very short period of time. But it's not worth it. It's not worth it. Don't do it, okay? Learn your lesson. Don't do it. I'm going to. It's so weird because it's 520. It's pitch black outside. The sun just sat. That's a weird word to say. The sun just sat. It's kind of a it's kind of a bar, to be honest. That's kind of a bar. The sun just sat. Um the sun just set. The sun just sat. The sun just set. I don't know. Anyways, um, but it's 520 and it already is pitch black outside now, so that's weird. Because it feels like the day's over, but it's not over. Like normally this I would just be getting stuff done. Like I am getting stuff done. But I just kinda need to get it out of my head. Um Uh, I need to keep reading more of that book. Might go, I wish there was somewhere else I could go. I don't want to go home and work because I'm just tired of being at home. I'm trying to see where else I could go. If I might want to get dinner somewhere. Um, I don't know, but maybe I'm going to go home and sit with Teddy and be all cozy. Maybe I'm going to go for a drive. I don't know, you guys. I don't know. I don't know. Growing up is weird. Growing up is truly weird. Not even growing up. Just it's just. Just existing is weird. Just being a human is weird in a good way, in an amazing way. Like, it's so cool, but it's so just like, hmm. especially in these times. Anyways, I love you. Teddy and I got ice cream. We got some vegan ice cream we love. He is so happy. He has his little sample. He's so cute. Oh my gosh. Teddy. Hi, baby. Hi, Teddy. I love you. He's obsessed. He's obsessed.